All right, so I'm out here today, Galveston. Jetty's right here, and we are going with a getter done rig. Have a J hook with a bait keeper on it, one ounce weight, pink gulp swim mullet. I'm out here company today by Eric. I've already seen a few people catch some flounder, so. We are going to hope that we have the same kind of luck. Eric's behind me. He's going to be set up. Just after sunrise. Sunrise about maybe 20 minutes ago. So just after sunrise. That was a nice hole I just stepped in. Got to remember, shuffle your feet. There's flounder out here, but there's still stingrays. Thanks for coming back. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Get this morning started. Damn. I told you to hit that lure. Don't do that. I really put him down. <laughs> Eric out here with his first cast of the first day. First cast of the day, little baby. We only little keep, baby. We only keep, keep him kid. big, thick. We keep the big girls. There's a big girls only club. Yeah. Hooks up to free. You got him? A little chipper. Another chipper. That's what you left off last time. Yeah. There's the cat, catch and master. Catch and master. <laughs> Had to give you that solid shot. Get my lineup. There you go. Eric, what this? What does that make for you? Two? Three? Three. Three for the morning. Mm -hmm. Ruben still sticking on the goose egg. Nah. Oh. 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 <laughs> he is silly. Yep. Uh, dang. You got another one? There you go. I think that's a keeper? I don't think so. It look it looks smaller than the last one you just had. Man, that boy got a 20 in there. I don't think so. It might be a 17. Nah, that's a 20, dude. Here you go. Drop a quick quick one on the little one. 15 and a half. Uh, Almost 16. Oh look at that, somebody had him. That's a nice fish. Yeah. Probably 18 close. Yeah. Close to 18. 17 three quarters. 17 three quarters. There we go. Oh, that's a heavy one. 
he felt heavy. He was really latched on the bottom. Close to size, the same one. The other one I got. Dang it. Need one more crank on this reel. There we go. Woo! It is hard to net these fish at your freaking ankles, man. You know what I mean? Well, you got longer arms than I do. I got a little, little gator on it, man. I can't do too much with these, you know what I mean? Pay for the check. <laughs> Baby, can you get that out the top shelf? Hold on, let me get my step ladder. Yeah. Hey. Let me get my stool. All right, let's hey, check this guy out. Man. Let's check this guy. This guy's a nice one right here. He's a good one. He's a good guy. Seventeen and a quarter. Huh? Seventeen and a quarter. Nice guy right there. Seventeen and a quarter. Going the old stringaroo. Uh oh. I try not to cross you. Oh, I do I'm trying to get tangled up. You do? Yeah, that was it made me feel like it was. Eric has another fish on. Let's go, dude. Hook up. Oh, my God. Got a fish? Yes, sir. Hey, man. Don't we splash me in the face? Drop it down, drop the head in the water. <laughs> yeah. I'll, I'll try to see the tip of his head. Okay. That's a better fish. 17. Okay, we're looking at a near 17 inch flounder. Could be, it's always hard to measure them when you're standing up or having lean on stuff, so it's like a quarter inch either way. But we don't ever keep anything close to, to under, or close to being barely slot anyway. We always keep about an inch, an inch over. There you go. That's a hooker. That's a hook set. Feel yeah, like good one. Oh, that's a good one. I hate, I never go backwards, man. I never net backwards. I don't like netting them backwards. Dang, Eric. Put the thing down so I can bring it to the That's a big one, boy. Yes, sir. Look at that one. Yes, he's been, he's been right back to back spots too, yep. man. See, that's what we say. There's, you're gonna, you get one, you'll get another one. You know. Ooh. That is a nice looking fish, bro. Oh, <gasps> dude, I have some pictures of you losing the fish. Oh yeah. my god, your face. <laughs> it's hilarious. It's hilarious. There we go. everybody so i am back at home as you see chilling with my little girl right here she's just waking up from a nap i'm pretty sure i need one myself 
But hey, I just want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. You know, Eric and I spend a few days out there, uh, a couple back-to-back -back days fishing that South Jetty in, in uh, Galveston, Texas. And he actually went back today, and he got a couple of nice pair of 19-inch flounder. So we just had a cold front that came through this week and what that does a lot of times that will trigger the flounder to move and they'll move in large groups like we've been seeing down there all week now throughout this week we have had reports i've seen reports from nice flounder being caught texas city up and down the ship channel and also in that ferry landing channel that seawolf park area i know a few guys have told me they limited out there as well not that catching two flounders is a big deal but it is pretty great to be able to go out there and catch a quick limit and do a little bit of weight fishing but anyway if you are out there i suggest you find some goat buy some goat try try that get her done rig i did a recent video on it if you haven't seen it yet i will leave the description for that below but i would suggest to get out there buy some goat or use your favorite lure the colors for us i was working was pink well actually no i didn't catch anything on pink both days I didn't catch anything on pink. I don't know what was up with that. Typically pink is a really good color, but uh, white, root beer with chartreuse tail, chartreuse, and new penny. Shrimp and the swimming mullet were very effective. I typically like the shrimp a little more because they seem like they hold up a little longer, but having that swimming mullet really gives a nice finesse tail. It's a lot of, lot of good water movement. But anyway, don't want to ramble on too much. Just want to thank each and every one of you for watching. Don't forget to come back and subscribe, share, comment. Follow us on social media. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video. If not, hopefully I'll be able to do a better job for you guys next time. And I hope next time you catch me hooking up. Thanks.